It's a problem that's going down the drain. Literally, bacon fat. The Halifax Water Utility says too many people are pouring it down the drain, so it's clogging up the wastewater system. Now there is a video that illustrates what is a very serious and sticky situation. CTV's Ron Shaw shows us. The title is Bacon Responsibly. It begins with all the recipes you might imagine or more than you might want to imagine for bacon, but it's really about what you do with the leftover grease. Um, I mean, it's probably bad, but I just put it in the toilet and <laughs> flush it down, and I don't use it at all. It is bad and getting worse, which is why Halifax Water commissioned the video. Uh, using a little bit of humor to try and uh, shed some light on a pretty serious problem, which is fat, oil, and grease being poured down people's drains and through businesses' drains into, into the sewer system. Fat, oil, and grease, also known by the acronym FOG. The video uses a simple experiment to show what happens when cooking fat gets into the wastewater system. When a fat clog the size of a bus plugged a sewer pipe in London, England, a word entered the English language. The term now is fatberg, where you get a, a large blob of fat which can actually block the sewer line. So as it, when it cools, it hardens and we have to have that truck go out. He's talking about this kind of truck, which fires high-pressure water into the clogs to break them up, suck them up and haul them away for disposal. If you think fog or fatbergs don't cost us money, well consider this. Halifax Water owns six of these super vacuum trucks and they cost about half a million dollars a piece. Plus maintenance and staffing costs. Some of us know what we are supposed to do. I'll just throw it in a can and then end up throwing it in the garbage. I don't know, what do you do? So what are you supposed to do with that leftover bacon grease? Ideally, you should put it right in here, in your green cart. There's another reason not to pour it down the drain. Because it's not good for your plumbing. Chances are, long before it creates problems for the public sewer system, it will clog up your own drains, resulting in a sewer system back up into your house and an expensive fix and clean-up bill you'll have to pay for yourself. Ron Shaw, CTV News, Halifax.